over here! I know this is a bit late, but Merry Christmas. Uh, we were supposed to put these videos out before Christmas, but, you know, life keeps me preoccupied sometimes. Anyway, uh, these three ROM hacks were all available at romhacking.net just by searching the term uh, Christmas ROM hack. And uh, a whole bunch came up. We picked the top six to play. And uh, these are the three that I decided to play. This one here is a Mega Man 2 modification, and it's really just a uh, one boss level. The hack was created in 2016 by Imagine Jiku, if I'm pronouncing that right, I could be totally wrong, but uh, it was his Christmas special to the world in 2016, and it was actually pretty fun to play. A Mega Man is decked out in some sort of Christmas attire, and uh, so is the uh, the boss, which appears to be a Christmas tree. Um, like I said, you could only play the one boss level. Woodman is his name. Uh, clearly a Christmas tree, if I had to guess. Uh, I could be wrong. A Mega Man's attire is pretty nice, too, if I do say so myself. So, uh, what do you think we're looking at here? Uh, my opinion, it's clearly a Christmas tree, right? I don't know. And, uh, not really sure what he's shooting. Uh, perhaps those are, um, tree ornaments, I think? Christmas bulbs, perhaps? I'm not sure. And Mega Man is shooting... I don't know what those... Snowballs. I'm gonna say he's shooting snowballs, and... Snowballs are also falling from the screen. Uh, all in all, I guess I would give it a 7 out of 10. Good job, buddy. After defeating him, you get a nice little uh, Christmas message wishing you a Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. And that's it. It loops back into the same stage, so that's all we were ever meant to do. Moving on, we have Luigi and the Christmas Quest. This game was a modification of the original Mario Brothers for the Nintendo Entertainment System. Um, right off the bat, you can see there is quite a bit going on here that's, a li that's, that's different from the original game. Uh, for starters, Luigi jumps a lot higher. And for some reason, I think that messes with the overall, um, the overall responsiveness of the game itself. Um, but he totally reskinned a great portion of the game. A lot of the enemies um, definitely have Christmas-themed um, elements to them. I don't know what that turtle is there. I have no clue. But um, he's definitely shooting ice balls when he gets his fire suit here. And um, they shoot straight rather than... Oh, I got nerfed. Apparently you can't... Oh, you can't run on top of the screen... Those turtles definitely look like, um, I don't know, I have no idea. <laughs> but it's definitely a little harder to control than the original uh, Mario for the system. Like I said, I think it's it's 
how they have him jumping, um, it messes with the responsiveness of the game itself. But uh, it makes it a little harder to play, and the modifications here are... The levels are much harder than the, the original Mario. I would compare this game to the Lost levels in terms of difficulty. And, like, right now the current is really sucking me in a lot harder than the original game. You really have to fight to get through it. Um, so pretty cool that he was able to twist that up. Uh, this Hammer Brother is throwing candy canes. And the big bullets are definitely snowballs, so that's pretty cool. The one-ups look, or the big guys look like, uh, I don't know, Smurfs? I don't know what those things are. Um, but he definitely put a lot of time and thought into this game. Um, very, very well done overall. Like I said, the only thing I don't like, and I'll say it a third time, is the overall responsiveness. It's just, it's off a little bit. As you can see, I'm trying to long jump here, and I'm just, I'm not getting the job done uh, at all. Uh, played through the first few worlds, and maybe I'll revisit this again one day and see how it ends. The final ROM hack was a Pac-Man Christmas hack made by uh, handle user the Losa, if I'm pronouncing that right. Probably not. Uh, it's Pac-Man for the Nintendo. There really isn't that much to report here. Uh, the ghosts that you see are now wearing Christmas hats, and um, the intermission scenes that take place in between every three levels are uh, a little different. That's that's really about it. Uh, nothing too special, but because I do love Pac-Man, I ended up playing this for a half an hour anyway. Uh, all in all, if you're interested in trying out any of these ROM hacks, or thousands more, please visit the site romhacking.net. You can download these patch files for uh, as many games as you can think of and uh, patch the ROM and load it up in your favorite emulator and give them a go. In the future, if interested, I'll definitely run through some more ROM hacks, probably some of my favorite ones. And uh, my friend Ryan, who also uploads a great deal to this channel, a lot more than I have, has also done some Christmas hacks as well, and I think he is posting that video shortly. Uh, if interested, his um, narrative skills are probably much more interesting than mine. So that's it. Um, thank you very much for watching, and have a good night.